January's edition of School Administrator unpacks a myriad of global and multicultural topics. Paul Reed's article, Tuition-Paying Students from Abroad, takes us not to the UN, but upstate New York to a town with a mere 425 residents. Newcomb Central School District is home to what its leader calls an international school. To the point now, if you come to Newcomb, you will see um, um, kids from all over the world. We've had kids from like 130-some different nations. More and more international students are attending U.S. high schools through F-1 visas, allowing them to earn a high school diploma and pursue a collegiate degree. Any school district starting an F-1 program, you are totally reestablishing culture. The culture of that district is going to change. Change by faith, by color, by academics. There's so many changes that take place. And in reality, kids are kids. When they come here, it's not like, oh, he's a Muslim, or he's a Buddhist, or he's an African, or he's an Asian. It really just comes down to, he's my friend. Newcomb's international students pay $3,500 a year in tuition. Coupled with $6,000 for support provided by host families. Password. All in all, it's probably the most worldwide. Is, I bet you can do it from Zimbabwe very Yeah, he's only here. And in changing that family, we've changed ourselves and understanding that we can impact the world. Maybe not the whole globalized world, but we can change the world one person at a time. To read January's issue of School Administrator, visit the AASA website or join the conversation on Twitter.